President, the Vice Premier of the People's Republic of China. Mr. Mm -hmm. Premier, well, welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Pleased to have you here. Thank you. I'm also very pleased to meet you. Mm -hmm. On him. Nice to see you, sir. Vice President. Nice to see you. This is Don Regan. How are you? Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Now it's a, I don't know 
know what that is. No, I know what that is. That's a satellite. Yeah. That's, that's, that's what that's what that's 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 the thing they used to shoot up to the dish. That's what I mean. uh, okay. We have some networks now that probably use cardboard cameras. <laughs> <laughs> satisfied making love. And I said, well, I wouldn't know. And he said, well, I didn't think you would. And <laughs> 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 away he went. You <laughs> 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 oh, that road and that whole thing there, you, you bent me off on one that I, not that salty, but it's, the fellow driving down the road and he looked out to the side and there was a chicken keeping pace alongside him. He, he stepped it up, you've all heard this one? Yeah. He stepped in the gas and finally he's do, doing about 60 and the chicken then just spurts and goes out ahead of him, makes a left turn or right turn and down a lane while he skids into the right turn and follows him down, ends up in a barnyard and there's a farmer standing there. And he stopped and he said, did you see a chicken come through here? Not real fast. And the farmer said, uh, yeah, it's one of mine. Well, he said, am I crazy? He said, it looked to me like the chicken had three legs. And the farmer says, yep, I breed them that way. Well, he says, why? Well, he says, me and Mom, we both like the drumstick. And he says, now with Junior, he likes it too. And he said, we just got tired of fighting over it, so I bred him with three, three legs. Well, he said, how do they taste? He says, I don't know. We haven't been able to catch one. <laughs> <laughs> See you all tonight. Well, I'm pleased to do it. Paying tribute here to an $800 billion transportation industry, vital now, to our economy. <laughs> if I say that I signed this May 15th, which it is, mm -hmm. but the week began May 11th, didn't it? Why don't yes. I sign it 11th May? Huh? <laughs> all right to cheat a little bit? I think we're all right, yes. Nobody will tell. Yeah. We won't tell <laughs> so we know what you're committed to. <laughs> I have uh, hopes. I'm sorry. I messed it up a little bit. I'm always amazed that sometimes 
they get these things to me after the week is over. <laughs> <laughs> and I feel silly about the date. Efficiency of government, sir. That oh, is I done. appreciate that very much. And I think the Secretary of Transportation ought to have some. I will cherish it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> very okay. good. Thank well, you. Thank appreciate you. the time and look forward to seeing you soon. Good. Yes. Have a good day now. All right. Thank you. Well, we leave it behind. Yeah, we leave it. Right? Okay. Very good. Thank you, right. again. Before we start business, I want to show you something. Do you remember this? This was up in Concord. Oh, yes. yes. That's a yes. prized picture for our family. I want yeah. to kind of give you a little update on our adopted son. Hey. Sunday. Well, look at that. <laughs> I got it. You're doing great. This is one we saved from abortion. Yes. Yes. We saved them like that too. I understand. <laughs> and I couldn't remember it accurately, so I looked it up in my collection of quotes. You might be interested in it. You know, there's a man named Gus Hall, who's still head of the Communist Party in America. Mm -hmm. Well, in February of 61, he spoke at the funeral of Eugene Dennis, who was then the head of the Communist Party in America, who died. And in his eulogy at the funeral, he made this statement. I dream of the hour when the last congressman is strangled to death on the guts of the last preacher. And since the Christians seem to love to sing about the blood, why not give them a little of it? Slit the throats of their children and draw them over the mourner's bench of the poet and allow them to drown in their own blood and then see whether they enjoy singing those hymns. <laughs> what year was that? 1961. And he's still very active. He was just over in Moscow, a uh, party of Congress, uh, Congress a couple yes. months ago, and received some kind of award. And he came back, and he told a group of congressmen in California, because I have a friend who was there who's not a communist, there were two non-communists in that meeting in San Diego. And he told them he was bringing back the word he had met with Gorbachev. And he said that if by January 1st of this year, January 1st has just passed, if they had not been able to make sizable gains in their opposition to SDI, then, in the three months to follow, they would be the most important three months in world history because of what they would unloose on the world. And this is Linda's mother, Alice Goodwin. Hello there. Nice to meet you. And you and I get a photograph. Oh, all right. <laughs> right here, ma'am. Yeah. There we go. All right. And now I think the family ought to come in. Oh, well, all, all right. right. Uh, today. Oh, today. 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 One more. Thank you. Well, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, and congratulations. Well, thank you very much. I just was telling you that I was in Take all of the emissaries I can get. <laughs> <laughs> we certainly have our prayers. <laughs> no, we to see you. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Well, this, is, this is Don Reed over here. Hi, nice, nice to meet you. Thank you. And the Vice President. Very nice. How are you? So nice to see you. Nice to see you. Congratulations. Thank you, Mr. President. That's a wonderful. Exciting time. Yes, I'll talk to you before I leave. Okay, we'll wait for you. I know we've got to get up, so it keeps coming. <laughs> <laughs>